Nation's Attic, finding authentic, antique, vintage diving helmets from the depths of the sea and the internet. Serving the collector, investor, and museums worldwide. Nation's Attic is your source for what others want. Hi, my name is Don Creekmore, owner of the Nation's Attic, and today we have for sale a virtually flawless, beautiful, fully polished out United States Navy Mark V diving helmet. Now, Nation's Attic handles more of these Mark Vs than probably anyone else in the world, and we get a lot of calls from beginning collectors, investors, and people just researching the Mark V about polished examples. Now, the United States Navy had the Mark V made for them from 1915 until the mid-1980s and they were made by four different companies. Now after the 1980s there were still two companies that made the Mark V primarily for commercial divers and collectors as well and today there's only one of those companies left and that's Desco in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Now this particular helmet is fully polished out and it's quite unusual but also, this helmet was made relatively recently as well. It was made November 24th, 2010. And when we found this helmet, it had developed a bit of a patina to it, like a, a penny would, for example. So we have spent a number of hours going over this helmet in detail and polishing it. But when you get this home, uh, you may want to run some more polish over it. And it'll probably require a good polishing every year or so just to keep up this brilliance that it has. But if you leave it alone, it'll also develop a wonderful, consistent patina to it as well. As we mentioned earlier, the Navy, when they had these helmets made, had them tinned and it was coated in a gray material like a galvanizing. And that was put on there on the copper body of the helmet to protect it from saltwater corrosion. So these vintage helmets generally are all would have had that applied to them at the manufacturer. Now there's lots and lots of reproductions out there that are fully polished like this. And that really technically isn't the way they left the factory. But this helmet being one that was made relatively recently, this is how it was made. and was probably made on order just like this, more for a display piece to impress people that come into an office or a home. And that's exactly what this helmet does. Now, as we mentioned, this helmet was made by Desco, made November 24th, 2010. And that's right here on the ID plate. Now, the ID plate will also have the serial number of the helmet as well. And one interesting fact about Desco helmets, old ones, new ones, is that they're going to have that same serial number on the inside of the neck ring, of the neck ring of the breastplate here and of the bonnet. And on the inside of that neck ring will be the serial number. And it is, in this case, matching as it should be. Now, in addition, this helmet's complete, um, just like it left the factory. It's got all 12 of the solid brass wing nuts. It has all four of these beautiful solid brass brails. All the valves, all the fittings on the back of it are there. The guards, uh, the glass is all in mint condition. Inside the helmet, the air vents are present. There's also wiring and a speaker inside as well that was installed when it was made in 2010. Now, Nations Attic only handles 100% authentic helmets. We never handle reproductions. So anytime you see a fully polished example, you should be careful of it. But in this case, you have, there's no doubts about this one. Now, when these helmets, uh, when we get them sometimes, we do have customers ask us about polishing a vintage helmet. And it can be done, but it's difficult, it's very expensive, and typically in hard to reach spots like here on the breastplate, you just can't get all that old tinning out. And also, when you start polishing the copper body, any of those old working dents, uh, they're going to be almost amplified. You'll be able to see them a lot easier as well. But this helmet probably has never touched the water. It has no dents on it at all. Just an amazing, beautiful display piece. They could also go, it could be taken out and dove as well, but it would need to certainly be checked out by a certified dive shop or Desco before ever taking it in the water. 
Now with any helmet that Nations Attic sells, we're gonna send along a certificate of authenticity. And that will detail the serial number, the dates, things like that. It will show the helmet on the certificate as well. Great piece of documentation to keep with this helmet for future reference or if you ever sell it as well. Now Nations Attic can and we do professionally pack these helmets and we can ship them anywhere in the world. So just give us a call or an email if you'd like a shipping quote outside the United States. We can do it in a matter of minutes and provide that for you. Now to contact us, our phone number is country code 1, area code 316-371 1828. Our email address is helmets at nationsaddict.com. And also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel here as well. You'll know immediately when we pop up a brand new helmet and have a video featured of it as well. The Nation's Attic is a proud sponsoring member of the Historical Diving Society in the United States of America. We're a full-time corporation here and we have an A-plus rating with the Better Business Bureau. Once again, my name is Don Creekmore, owner of the Nation's Attic, and please feel free to give us a Call, email, text, anytime. Happy to talk about these beautiful vintage helmets. See you later.